Christy here, and I hope that you enjoyed hearing the story of our superhero, Jeremiah, from Pastor Janet and Francis Reynolds. They did a great job of letting you know what Jeremiah's struggles were and how God reassured him that he would be there with him. So we all know that Jeremiah had to do some tough things, some scary things, some things he did not want to do. And I bet you can think of some things in your life that have been tough or that you've been afraid to take that first step to do. I bet you can think of some of those things. But you know what? The great news is that God is greater. He is stronger than all of those fears, than all of those things that are holding you back. He is with you and can help get you through anything. So our craft today is going to help us remember that God is greater than any of our fears or struggles. And I have Margaret here to help demonstrate you should have gotten in your surprise package this week, you should have gotten a paint pen and three rocks and a little baggie with the drawstring. And I have put a piece of paper. If you have some scrap paper or a note card or just um, even a piece of newspaper that you can put inside this bag. I want you to go ahead and do it and just hold it there for later. And if you can have something that you can mark on that's not going to be a problem that you can throw away. I want you to have something like that. I'll take a moment for you to get it. And while you're doing that, I'm going to get Margaret to open up her paint pen. And when you're ready, we're going to activate our paint pens one of my favorite parts. All right, so shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. And then dab, 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 dab. You're gonna push, push, push on it until you see a little dab of paint. All right, see that? All right, that's what you're going for. All right, now, the next thing I want you to do is I want you to think of things in your life that are struggles for you the things that might interfere with your faith, interfere with your trust in God. And I want you to either draw a picture on each rock of one of those things, or you can write a word. I'm gonna let Margaret, what, which one are you gonna do, Margaret? I'm probably gonna do fear. Okay, okay, so you're gonna write a word, okay? And you're gonna write the word fear. Tell me about fear. What do you, what are some of the things that might? Sometimes I fear going to school and taking tests. Okay, great, great. Okay, so you're gonna write fear. All right, so if you have three rocks, I want you to write three things or draw three pictures on each rock. Things that have challenged your faith things that make it tough to do the kind of job you wanna do for God. If you want to go ahead and pause the video so that you have time to work on your rocks, you can decorate them any way you want to, but I just want you to keep in mind the things that stand in your way. and That's what you wanna to, to represent on your rocks. All right, so go ahead and work on that. All right, okay, so after you have written or drawn on your three rocks, I want you to take your bag and your paint pen and you or you and a helper, you're gonna write, God is greater. All right, when you finish writing, God is greater, I want you to put those three stones inside your bag and pull that drawstring. Put those stones in there really, hold them tightly. All right, so this symbolizes, the stones in the bag symbolize 
are trusting God, that he knows the stones on our heart, the things that we carry in our hearts. He knows them and he is going to hold them with us, help us carry those burdens and help us overcome those burdens. I hope you've enjoyed our craft time today. Feel free to decorate your bag any other way. And as you go through the week, I want you to really hold on to this and think. Anytime you struggle, say, God is greater. God is greater.